over to Marvin Webster. Is Facebook spying on you? Yes, but it's probably not what you think. On this edition of Tech Talk. It happens all the time. You're at the coffee maker at work. A friend of yours tells you about his new car. You mention you just saw the new Hyundai Sonata, and you think it looks surprisingly good. When you get home and check your Facebook feed later that day, you see an online ad for the new Hyundai Sonata. You didn't mention it to anybody except the guy at work, and he hasn't mentioned it to anybody else. So obviously, Facebook must have been listening in on your conversation at the coffee maker at work, right? Well, not exactly. And here's why. Facebook has almost 3 billion active users. That is a lot of conversations to eavesdrop on. Do the people at Facebook have time to listen to all of them every day? No, they do not. So you think, aha, maybe Siri was listening. Maybe Alexa told them. Well, computers are very good at eavesdropping. They don't need to eat or sleep or take a bathroom break so they can have their ears on 24-7, 365. But there are not enough computers in the whole world to listen to every boring-ass conversation <laughs> that three billion people have during the day. And you know what? They don't need to listen in. Here's why. Facebook put something called cookies on your computer. What it is is a little piece of computer code that keeps track of everything you do online, even when you're not on Facebook. They know every name on your friends list, every website you go to, every ad you click on, every show you watch on TV, every call you make on your smartphone. Multiply that by three billion. That is a whole lot of info about what people like. So Facebook basically has a full report on what you do all day, every day. How'd they get it? Well, that's the funny part. You gave it to them. You not only uploaded pictures of all your family and friends, you said, oh, and here, let me tag the names on those for you. <laughs> and here's a picture of what I ate at last night's restaurant, too. <laughs> so to answer your question, the good news is Facebook is not actually listening in on your conversations. The bad news is they don't need to. They have so much intel on you, they knew you were going to mention the Hyundai Sonata at work before you did. And the really bad news is there's a good chance the salesman at the Hyundai place knows it now, too. So, you know, good luck with that. And that's a wrap for this edition of Tech Talk. Till next time, this is Marvin Webster. Peace.